What is up, you two? It's your boy, AJ for the win. Back at it again with yet another shoe video. Man, it's been a long time since I said this, man. It's been a long time. But nonetheless, man, we are back with another video. Um, And as you can see by the title, man, we got lucky, man. We got super lucky on a raffle. But if this is your first time, appreciate you for checking in. And secondly, man, I need you to like the video. I need you to comment down below, turn on post notifications, all that good stuff, leave a like on the video. It goes a long way. It would really, really be appreciated by me and it'll just make the channel grow and go out there even further. Um, but man, as you can see by the title again, man, we got Lucky on the raffle from our mom and Gare, like out of all things. And uh, we gotta open up this box, man. We gotta open up this box. So while I'm opening it up, I'll just tell you a little bit of how I was able to secure my pair. So basically what happened was, in my city actually has an Ama Minier, but it's a social status. Um, I was able to go online and you have to book an appointment with them. And um, you know, basically the day your appointment comes, you go in there, it's quick, you show me your ID, uh, you verify your email address, um, it's the same email address. And just like that, you're in the raffle. Afterwards, after they get all of the, the entries and all that good stuff, then they just choose the winners. And your boy was chosen as a winner, but it wasn't in person. So they ship it out to me. And you know, I was just able to get it in into the mail so I can, you know, do the video for you guys. But without further ado, man, I open up the box. And as you can see right here, we got our Alma Meyer Jordan 1. It's like it's just a crazy retail dub so i'll go ahead and show you guys and look at this man look at this box look at this box presentation if you have the threes you're able to you know you already know what the um i guess what this little slingy um looks like um i actually do have the threes um and maybe one of these videos i'm going to show you guys like a little comparison of which one i think is better out of the th out of the shoes between these threes and the jordan ones but man as you can see right here you just see all the a's just popping up on here just all around so let's go ahead and put this to the side and let's look at the shoe box so first we see it's obviously a collab so we got our sale print that i'm on me on top jordan box right here in the burgundy as well as the Amon and Meniere branding right here and the Air Jordan right there. Amon and Meniere on the back of the box right here. And size tag reads Air Jordan 1 Retro Ohio GSP for special project. And it says sell burgundy and crush right there. And then in my personal size, size 11 right there. So let's go ahead and peel this box down. And as you, oh my goodness, hold on. So we got a, look at this box right here. Look at this. It says the Jordan Amon Meyer and actually Jordan's actual symbol of the picture that I was actually taking. And you can see, man, the presentation on Jordan boxes when it's an SP is just, you know, marvelous. So going back into the shoes, you can see right here, the Amon Meyer paper and it's our little burgundy around it with our little tag up here. You know, make sure your shoes real people, make sure it's real. Um, and as we peel this down, we see there it is, the Air Jordan 1 Amma Meniers. And boom, there we have it, man, the Air Jordan 1 Amma Meniers um, with our extra laces right here and our sail colorway, as you can, you know, see it right there. But man, I'll just give you guys a quick 360 of the shoe right there. Man, first things first, you can tell this is a definitely a special project it says i'm on the air up here man like the quality and like you would never see this on a regular gr jordan that's that's for sure that's for sure man let's just get into the review so on the bottom you see we have our bordeaux color on the bottom right here and um you know you see the cell bottom is really cell on the bottom as you can see it covers the whole bottom part of the shoe and really there's really nothing else to talk about the shoe the whole shoe is going to be your little white little um i'll show you guys a little close-up of it in a little bit um so it's going to be our little white on the outside with our little burgundy and i'll zoom it so you can see the kind of the texture of the shoe we see it looks like a little reptile print right there on the burgundy and then you know our chap lips i heard about this chap lips on this leather right here it covers basically the whole entire back part of the shoe as well as the front part of the shoe and even towards a little bit everywhere else but it's not as bad as like the front part of the shoe and the back part of the shoe so going in quick review on the inside of the shoe right here we have our quilted inside you can see it right there um it really kind of does look like the threes in a way and then the bottom of the shoe right here it says a little saying and then if you can read it on there right there it says um airness by air jordan i'm on the air you know all that good label size 11 read it my personal size um and then you can see these these little laces that they have in this bordeaux with these little aglets little silver hits right there and then going into the other shoe right here we have our little hang tag right there with the Amon Meyer branding right here 
and then our Jordan 1 logo, as well as this side. And the tongue really is the, the kicker because it says like the Nike Air regular, but also says Air Alma Meyer again, like I said before. So my final thoughts on this shoe. I think that this shoe is definitely well constructed. You can tell it's a collab with another, um, you know, brand outside of Jordan because of the, just the quality in which they use on this shoe is, but let's, let's be for real. No hype aside, it is a kind of plain shoe. All we got is our little Bordeaux white and then sale. If this wasn't an Alma Meyer, it didn't have the crazy leather quality and all that good stuff, will it sell out? Yes, it will, because it's a Jordan 1, but will it be like too big of a resale? Probably not. So right now they're like around, my size definitely for sure is probably around $400. Um, definitely wait. If you haven't copped this for retail yet, I would say just hold on a little bit, just a little bit until after all the pairs get in hand. Um, so like a little week or so from sneakers app, um, it might be a little later based on the shipping, you know, it's, it's holiday season. So maybe a little bit later with the shipping, but this is definitely a clean shoe. Um, I'm glad to have it in the collection for sure. You know, I don't hit on collabs. Let me know down below your thoughts on this shoe. And do you think that, you know, the is better than the Jordan three? I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to have to hold on my thoughts on that for, for right now, but it's definitely a clean, clean, clean shoe for real. Um, so let me know down your thoughts on this shoe. Are you able to cop for retail? You're going to pay resale. Um, leave a like on the video, leave a comment down below, turn up post notifications, all that good stuff. Cause like I said, man, we're going to drop a whole bunch of bangers. The 11s come out next week. We got to go for them for sure. Um, but man, without further ado, man, you know, I'm AJ for the win. I got the shoe right here and we out. I just might pull up in robes, chop up, make you hit the wall. Shining got eye when I'm high, so they low. I ain't no Cherokee, but I told Pose.